All right, guys, this is Big J coming back at you from Lizard Juice. Uh, as you can see, we got some new surroundings. Um, but anyway, today we are going to talk about batteries, okay? Uh, Lizard Juice is going to be carrying three different types of 18650 batteries, um, and these are going to be good for our devices. I'm not saying they're the end-all, be-all for every device out there and everything that you're going to do, but they will work perfectly fine with all the devices that we offer and probably will offer in the, fruit in the future. So that being said, let's dip down, we'll check them out. Uh, you've probably already heard of a couple of them, um, but I do have one that you may not have heard of. Uh, pretty outstanding battery, not gonna lie. Um, so anyway, enough of this, let's get down here, let's check them out. All right guys, and here they are. Um, you're probably familiar with our Samsung 25Rs, uh, the good old Sony VTC4s. Um, the new kit on the block is gonna be the Doken um, 3000 milliamp. Um, I'm just going to run over a couple things real quick. All three of them, 18650s, obviously. Uh, your Samsung is going to be a nickel uh, battery. The other two, manganese. Um, as far as milliamp hours go, you got your 2500 milliamp, 2100 milliamp, and like I said previously, 3000 milliamp. Uh, you've got a max of 20 amp output here on your Samsung. You've got 30 amp on your VTC4. Then you got a 35 amp on your Doken. Um, that being said, according to their websites and their paperwork and all that good stuff that I got here, um, you have 3.6 volt on the Samsung, 3.7 volt on the Sony, and 3.8 volt on the Doken. Um, all that, then you start doing calculations. Uh, you've got Samsung, according to the Ohm's calculator uh, that is easily available on the internet, Samsung is safe down to 0.18, your Sony is safe down to 0.12, and your Doken is safe down to 0.10. So you got to look at them down below. Here they are again. Um, for all practicality and for what we're using uh, for the devices that we have at Lizard Juice and, uh, that we carry now and what we'll probably carry in the future, you've got your three options, okay? Uh, at this point, you've got your good. You've got your Sony, the better, and honestly, you've got the Doken as your best. Um, and like I said, for about a month now, I've been testing all three of these. Uh, and it's pretty self-explanatory on some of it. You know, I find this is a good battery, A, because the milliamp hours. Okay, it's 3,000 milliamp hours. That blows the Sony out of the water. Everybody loves Sonys. Blows the Samsung out of the water. Um, that extra 500 milliamp hours, pretty awesome. Um, your 35 amp, you know, beats your Sony, beats your Samsung. Um, not that you're going to build super low, because like I said, um, let me look at my notes again. It's not a huge difference. You know, the Samsung's going to give you a 0.18, the Sony's going to give you a 0.12, and the Doken's going to give you a 0.10. Everything we sell is a regulated box anyway, um, so you're fine there. Um, but here they are, guys. If you want, check them out. Uh, lizardjuice.com um, if you like these batteries give us a thumbs up uh, if you want to try these batteries give us a thumbs up but again like I said uh, we will have these tokens in stock either today which is Monday or tomorrow Tuesday um, check them out guys I think they're gonna be like a buck more than the Sony 50 cents something like that uh, I find it's well worth it for an extra couple pennies um, you know, so that I don't have to charge the batteries all the time. So I actually get some life out of it. Uh, good money, guys. Good money, good battery. Um, so that's it. Till next time. Till the next review. Big J, Lizard Juice. See ya.